Well, good grief, there's a giant pudsy bear right outside the BBC building here, outside Cardiff Rail Station. I'm back in Cardiff again for the second time in two weeks and hopefully, hopefully getting my new camera today. Hmm, what's going on? The taxi rank has been temporarily relocated. The one that's usually by here, by the station. It's an absolutely beautiful day again. It's a complete coincidence that the both days I've chosen to come into Cardiff, it's been lovely weather. I would have come rain or shine, but I'm very, very grateful for this lovely weather. And the lighting's beautiful. The Great Western Hotel's looking really lovely. I finally managed to commit to memory which arcade the camera shop is in, and it's Morgan Arcade. It's looking pretty festive in here too, isn't it? I mean, I am approaching. I'll speak to you when I've been in. Hopefully they have it. Okay, I got my new camera. This isn't it. I'm vlogging on my old camera. Oh my gosh, I'm scared. It's massive. This is massive and it's got a big, huge lens and it's like front heavy and I'm gonna have to get a bigger tripod for it than my little one because it's just gonna go pop like that fall over like doesn't fit in my bag that I normally take my cameras in so I'm gonna have to sort that out for now I've just it's in my rucksack oh learning curve do you know what I feel like I feel like I just left primary school and I've just stepped into secondary school it's big and scary. I'm just strolling very slowly down Mill Lane at the moment. Unexpectedly, I'm actually going to go and meet my daughter. Hmm, there's a big face up there. Can you make that out from behind the reflection? Very pretty lights there on the ceiling. Yeah, my daughter doesn't be in the vlogs these days, but she was originally. The whole channel used to be called Imo and Izzy and we were both equally part of it. But uh, no, she just got to a certain age, decided to branch off, do her own thing, be independent. And uh, anyway, she was supposed to be working this evening after college but she's had an eczema flare-up she went and ate prawns by accident in a lump of sushi from what i gather so she's in a bit of pain and it needs a bit of mummy time so i'm gonna go and take her to a cafe and buy her something to eat and i'll probably have a coffee and a cake or something i don't know and then we'll go home together the natural light is starting to go and the christmas lights are coming on i'm heading this way though Skateboarder boys are out skateboardering. I don't know where we're going for this bite to eat. I was going to go to Nasa and Co. And then when I found out that Izzy was coming, I was like, I just probably won't want to do that. I'll see what she wants to do. She's yeah. tried to talk me into sushi. After the sushi incident as well, I was like, well, I'm not really that hungry. And it's very expensive. <laughs> So can we just go to a cafe? I just want a coffee and a cake or something. Basically my bank balance has just gone into severe shock after that purchase in the camera shop. So to be fair, I got a really good deal because I bought a second hand camera body but a new lens. But I traded in an old GoPro. Oh, so I got £60 for the GoPro Hero 5 because I did a part exchange. And had a really old camera from my dad and it got £40 off because of that. So £100 off in total as well. Yay! <laughs> I have got a few more bits and bobs at home that I might be able to part exchange for lenses and things in future but I want to take the time to go through them carefully make sure there's not any footage on there that I still want that sort of thing. They're semi-archaic. Well one of them is uh, from when my daughter was little. She's 17 now so you can, as you can imagine I can't even remember how to get the images off the camera and onto the computer so there's that. Mm. Well, I've been talked into coming into a noodle bar, so I've got like a pumpkin curry. Oh, it looks like a big dollop, doesn't it? I'll have to give it a prod and see what consistency it is. Isabel's had beef teriyaki, and I've got a 7-Up free, and she's got a diet Pepsi. And we're sharing a great big bag of spring rolls, vegetarian ones. Right, I'm going to give it a prod. Oh, yeah, it's pumpkin, apparently. Oh, it can't, no, it's like got a lump in it. What is that, Izzy? What did they give me? I don't know. Mm, maybe I'd better ask them, because you can't taste it for me in case it's prawn. Izzy says it's definitely veggie. She said it's got a V sign next to it on the menu and her friend Matt had it last time and it was definitely veggie. I was the one that wasn't hungry, right? <laughs> <laughs> well, I had a small box though, to be fair. She had a medium box. Mmm, nice. Crunchy. Well, Izzy's just gone off to the toilet. <laughs> I just got this out, put it together and filmed my first shots, which won't be for the vlog because I had my daughter in it, but I wanted it to be the first thing that I filmed with my new camera. It's flipping massive, oh my goodness. <laughs> but I played back the uh, sound of it through my headphones because there's a, an input for headphones and the sound, I was really happy with it. And I think the mics, as from what I know, they're tiny little dots there, so I should be able to cover them very easy with a little fluffy sticker, you know, wind jammer. So I don't think wind noise should be a, an issue unless there's a third mic somewhere hidden. But I wondered because of where they're positioned if it would sound really quiet from when I was speaking behind the camera like I am now with this one. But it was fine, it was absolutely lovely. Oh, I'm so happy. It's, it's such a beast though, but I'll get used to it. But I do need, I, do, I need a bigger bag. That is just, it's not gonna fit. 
very snugly. <laughs> well, it'll, it'll fit, but it'll be a squeeze and there's no padding in this whatsoever. So I'm gonna get a new bag. IB is like Imogen, it's more important that you have something small and manageable. And I'm like, I just want better quality more than anything. So I'm just gonna develop some muscles. And um, they didn't want the old case that the dad's camera came in. So I've actually, for now, put the body of the camera in there to keep it protected in my rucksack and just the lens in the box with the bubble wrap for now as a temporary solution so that was kind of handy I'm just taking this couple of shots with my new camera of the food just so we can have a look at it and see if it looks any different from the one with that one and I'll do the same shot again now with the old one this feels really really light now all of a sudden the other one the old Canon right so this is the other one there we are we can compare and contrast we're heading off to get the train home now we're coming through an arcade now Right, I have a message for Annika, who comments and quite often asks, is Izzy watching Doctor Who? Isabel is now watching Doctor Who again. Sorry about the lighting, I've just, I've just given up. Look, look what I have to contend with. <laughs> Uh, anyway, yeah, she is watching Doctor Who again and you're enjoying it, aren't you? Mm -hmm. Going back into a Doctor Who phase again. This is the lighting we're dealing with in here today. It's very pretty. Kind of reminds me of a jellyfish. Bioluminescence. You know, it looks kind of organic, but it's not, obviously. Chilly. We've come outside. Those lights were doing something very nice a minute ago, now they've kind of gone like that. <laughs> but anyway, I'll just do a little plan down the street. Table, yay! I'm managing to do some editing on the train, but I must say, my hands are cold. <laughs> micro SD. I bought a micro SD today as well. One of those, it's the GoPro, so I got a spare. Well, what do you think? The lighting is appalling in this kitchen right now because it's the evening and I haven't got any proper vlogging lighting in it. But this is the new camera. I look a bit dishevelled so I just got back from Cardiff. I'm gonna have to get used to the monitor being over there as opposed to up there. So that's a little bit of a shift, but yeah, I'm testing out to see how it copes with the focus. Right, I'm gonna go down and come back up again. <laughs> I'm still in focus. <laughs> Oh dear, it's a small thing, isn't it? I'm cold, you know what? It's gone really, really cold out. It's been unseasonably mild for the time of year until sort of yesterday and now definitely today is proper cold. I urgently needed coffee. It's decaf mostly. I didn't have one this afternoon. Because we didn't end up going to a coffee shop. We ended up going to a noodle bar instead. One thing I can say about this camera is I, I do definitely need a wider angle lens because like, even with my arm outstretched quite a lot, I'm still quite on quite a close crop, do you know what I mean? But it zooms in. I probably don't want to zoom in on my face because it's quite late and I'm looking a bit haggard, but hey, it does that. <laughs> it's the best way to hold this. Oh, that's quite a good way, yes. Yeah. So I've got I've got it on the palm of my hand. It's quite a good balance, yeah. So I want to get my mirror and show you what I've done. That's killing my arm. It's hurt my arm. I am gonna look like a fiddler crab. That's what I'm gonna look like. Right, okay. Uh, so I've got it nestled. I can't, I can't coordinate this. This is just too much my poor brain. I swapped arms. <sighs> <sighs> right, I have no idea how long or short this vlog is because today didn't turn out as I expected it to turn out. I thought I was gonna be roaming around Cardiff and I thought I'll get lots of shots in Cardiff and it'll be a Cardiff shopping-y sort of vlog time in the cafe and then of course I met my daughter and of course I wanted to spend time with my daughter and go and have dinner with her and have a lovely time with her but because she didn't want to be in the vlogs it kind of restricts how much I was going to film so apologies if this turned out to be a short vlog I have to say I am shattered and all I want to do now is actually just chill out and have a rest and probably watch some videos on how to use this camera because it's a lot of complicated controls to learn so I'm going to say goodbye in this one and I'm going to see you in the next one thank you so much for watching this video please give it a like if you liked it subscribe for more videos from me and I will see See you in the next video, innit Ada? Yes! Ow.